Dear students, detailed civil engineering courses like Manual Building Design, Stat Pro, ETAP, SAP, Revert, AutoCAD, Primavera, P6 are available at Civil Engineering Stavan online application app. So download the application from the Google Play Store now. Each course contains 50 plus high quality video contents and free PDFs and exercises and online certification will be provided after completing the course. Course will be available at 67 to 70% discount now and valid up to 6 months. Download Civil Engineering application now from Google Play Store or direct link is available at the description of this video. Try to utilize this offer. Please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering concepts. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Civil Engineering by Shravan. So in the previous class, we are done with complete designing of building structural model which is placed in south facing direction by using ETAP software. In this video class, I will explain you how to design the G plus 12 building structural model by using ETAP software with the help of CSI detailing version software. Okay, so here I am using 2018 version ETAP software, ETAP's 18 version software. If you have the advanced version software, you can use that. But in advanced software, the CSI detailing version software was coming with the built-in version. You can check that uh, built-in versions also. And if you want the uh, ETAP's uh, CSI detailing version 18 version, so you can once pin me to my WhatsApp number which is available in the community tab or description of this video. So you can text me to that uh, WhatsApp number so that I will share you the link for the downloading process. And uh, if you want the installation process related to the uh, STAD or ETAPS or SAP, any software, you have to take my uh, course uh, from Civil Engineering Stavan application so that uh, I will give you the installation process. So you can utilize this offer. Those who really want the complete knowledge regarding the structural engineering as well as the analysis engineering and uh, architectural engineering, you can once download my application. The application link is available in the below description of this video and you can check the complete details about the courses which is available in the application and free pdf is also available related to the complete uh, some manual designing sections and uh, some building plans and uh, some considerations as per the uh, specifications of the building structural model okay so let without wasting our time let's start with the g plus 12 building structural model design so here i am selecting my etap software so initially I will open my model then after that I will import the model to CSI detailing version then we will do the de designing process in CSI detailing software. Now here you can see the software will be open here like this click on file option click on open option. So here I am opening this model which is related to just I am selecting my desktop related to G plus 12 building. So here I am selecting G plus 12. So the initially the model will be open in ETAP software. So after that I will show you the what are the specifications that I was consider like grade of the concrete, grade of the steel and etc for this building structural model for the members. Now you can see this is the building structural model. This is the 2D view. This is the 3D view for this and this is the center to center distance between the columns for this building model. Now initially I will show you the specifications. So for this structure I was taken M30 grade concrete and HYSD of 500 grade. Again in the same process I was taken frame section which is consisting of uh, approximately uh, 0 0.69 cross 0 0.46 for the beam section. Again in the same process for the column I was taken 690 cross 300 for the column section. And in the same process for the slab section we will check the slab thickness which is approximately equal to 150 mm. So I was already applied the load cases uh, related to the static load cases as well as the dynamic load cases related to dead load, live loads, uh, earthquake load, wind loading condition system. So now we will design this particular building structural model. Before designing of the building structural model, initially we need to add the strip condition systems for the slab. So for that go to edit option here. So here it is consisting of the add edit grid strip condition system. We have to select this uh, add grid strip condition. So initially it will open your story number 12. Just I am selecting direction X with the strip layer is A. Click on apply. In the same process, we have to proceed with Y direction condition system, strip condition system also. Without adding the strip condition system, we can't get the results related to uh, reinforcement design results of the slab. So that's why we have to add the strip condition system for the model. Just I am selecting click on apply option so that it will apply the strip condition system for the 12th story. In the same process, we have to select the story number 11. So just I am selecting direction which is in X direction with the strip layer is A. Click on apply option so that it will apply the strip condition system at the 11th story X direction condition. Now I am selecting Y direction condition 
with the strip layer is b so that it will apply the complete strip condition system for the uh, 11th story in the same process i am applying the strip condition for the remaining stories Now we can see here I was applied the all the strip condition system for every floor. Click on OK option here. Now after this we have to do the analysis process with uh, once again for this model under the considerations of the strip condition system for the different floor section from the twelfth story to first story section. So for that go to click on the Run Analysis option here so that it will do the analysis process for the building model. Then we can easily proceed with the designing process. Now here you can see this is the deflection diagram under the considerations of the strip condition system. Now we will design this building which is related to frame sections design slab section design. For that go to design option here. Select the concrete frame design. Initially we need to select the view revised preferences. We will check this whether it is having IS code or not and which is related to step by and the number of curves year 24. Click on OK. If you know the values then you can enter here otherwise directly keep it as constant. So go to design option again, concrete frame design, select to design, uh, start designing check option here. Okay. So that it will start designing of the member related to beams columns for this model. Now here you can see. Uh, it was done with complete designing of the member. Some of the members it is showing red color mark which indicates the beams or columns which are failing according to your given specifications. So in my upcoming video I will explain you how to reduce these warnings or errors uh, by using ETAP software. So after this we will design the structure related to the concrete slab design. So for that just I am selecting uh, uh, sorry for that just I am selecting concrete slab section. View revised preferences select IS 456 code click on OK. After this again go to design option concrete slab design directly click on the start designing check option. So it will ask you to select the floors. This time selecting floors from the 12th story to first story. So click on OK option so that it will start designing of the slab section from the 12th story to first story for the building structural model. Now you can see here it was done with complete designing of the slab. It is showing the slab strip design layer here like this. So now we have to save this model. So click on save option so that the model will be saved here. So now after this we have to open CSI detailing version software. So here I am selecting my CSI detailing 18 version software. So now we have to do the detailing in the CSI detailing version software. This is extension for the ETAP software. Okay. So click on the file option. Click on new detailing option. So here we have to select the open EDB file. This time selecting my desktop G plus 12 building. This time selecting here G plus 12 building. The initially model will be open in ETAP software. Then after that it will be imported to uh, CSI detailing version software. Now here you can see it was done with complete importing process. Some of the members are failing. That's why it is showing the warning message here like this. Click on okay, OK option. Now after this we have to select the detailing units here. Select the units in metric system and you can select the SI system from this particular rebar set. And length we will select in millimeter. Section thickness is millimeter. Rebar spacing is millimeter. Just I am selecting load case will be in kilo newton option. And rebar length meter and slab area is square meter volume is cubic meter rebar weight is kilogram click on ok then after that we will select the preferences use preferences as per is 456-2000 click on ok so after that we have to edit the rebar rules option here so you can consider the minimum spacing maximum spacing according to your consideration this time taking 120 is the minimum maximum is 450 for the beam sections again in the same process i am selecting this is 120 this is 120 again i am selecting this is also 120 and again in the same process 450 this is just I am selecting 450 
now i'm selecting 450 here and co for the column section just i'm selecting here as 120 again this is 450 let us consider and you can consider ok option here now after this we have to click on ok option so that it will start detailing of the members so now we can see it was started detailing of the particular member you can see the reinforcement design results for the building structural model of 12 story after uh, done with the complete uh, detailing process here okay so here you can see it is done with the complete slab sections frame sections as well as the column section detailing it is showing the complete layout here like this so this is the layout related to the 12th story so you can see here this is the layout and this is a sectional view for the 12th story section so if you want you can edit that uh, sectional view also so this is the floor framing plan at the 12th story and this is the rebar plan so you can click on the top rebar plan so that it will load the top rebars for this particular member section and this is the bottom rebar plan for this building structural model related to the 12th story so if you click on the all rebar plan option so that it will load the complete rebar section for the particular 12th story so you can click on the sectional view for the members and layer diagram and if you want you can click on the bill of material option so that it will show you the complete bill of material related to the 12th story and rebar quantity if you click you can see the complete rebar quantity here and directly just i'm selecting here as rebar cage view option so that it will load the complete cage view for the building structural model under the consideration now we can see it is loading the rebar cage view for the particular slab section so here it was done with complete loading process of the top rebar plan now it is loading the bottom rebar plan for these members so after loading process is completed it will load the complete the diagram which is related to the reinforcement option here like this so you can see here it is consisting of the reinforcement diagram for the 12th story here like this again we will select the beam detailing concrete beam select to framing plan so that it will show you the complete framing plan for that particular beam sections according to the 12th story so you can select the schedules and tables option it will be consisting of the complete schedules and table section this is the important one so for the complete reading of the results and complete execution of the site results okay so click on this uh, particular rebar material option it will show you the rebar material and you can click on the rebar quantity option and you can select the elevation select any one of the floor select any one of the beam section so that it will load the complete beam reinforcement design results for this particular building structural model here like this so you can see this is the reinforcement diagram in the same process we will see that concrete detailing option framing plan this is the framing plan for that particular center to center distance between the column and this is the schedule of the column material and this is the column concrete material rebar quantity directly select the section just i am selecting this uh, section related to 23rd section so directly i am selecting rebar cage view option so that it will load the complete rebar cage view for the particular column section which is consisting of approximately 300 cross uh, 690 mm dimensions for this members so you can see here this is the complete reinforcement diagram results which is comes under the column section so this is the complete process of the designing of the member by using etap software in detailing software version for the g plus 12 building structural model you can consider this building as medium rise building structural model so if you have any queries about this video please try to text me your questions in the below comment box without having the etaps detailing version software it was difficult to design the structural model according to the consideration so you you need to have extra detailing version software so if you want you can once pin me to my whatsapp number which is available in the below description of this video or community tab you can down directly text me so that i will share you the complete uh, etaps uh, detailing version software thank you for watching this video see you in the next one